Hello everyone. Today we're going to talk about a very special river, the Hamza River. The Hamza River is an underground river that flows beneath the Amazon rainforest, in Brazil and Peru. It was discovered in 2011 by a team of scientists from the University of Sao Paulo. The Hamza River is the largest known underground river, with about 6,000 kilometers in length and flowing at a depth of about 4,000 meters. It is fed by the rain that falls on the surface of the Amazon and flows towards the Atlantic Ocean. The Hamza River is an important reservoir of freshwater for the Amazon. It provides water for plants, animals, and human communities. The discovery of the Hamza River was an important discovery for science. It provided new information about the hydrogeology of the Amazon and can help scientists better understand the workings of the water cycle in the Amazon rainforest. Today, we're going to talk about the formation, maintenance of flow, importance, and future research on the Hamza River. The formation of the Hamza River is still a mystery to scientists. However, there are two main theories about how the river may have formed. Geological fault. One theory is that the river formed from a geological fault that allowed rainwater to penetrate the subsurface. Geological faults are cracks in the Earth's crust that can allow water and other fluids to move downward. Series of caves. Another theory is that the river formed from a series of caves that connected over time. Caves are formed by the erosion of water or ice. As caves expand and connect, they can create a system of underground flow. Scientists are conducting research to try to determine which theory is most likely. They are using a variety of methods, including geophysical analysis, satellite data analysis, and field studies. Maintenance of the flow of the Hamza River The Hamza River is a slow-moving river, flowing at a speed of about 1 meter per year. This is due to the fact that the river flows through sedimentary rocks that are relatively permeable. The rains that fall on the surface of the Amazon provide the water that feeds the river. Sedimentary rocks are rocks that are formed by the deposition of sediments, such as sand, clay, and gravel. These rocks are relatively permeable, which means that water can flow through them easily. The rains that fall on the surface of the Amazon provide the water that feeds the Hamza River. The rains infiltrate the soil and underlying rocks, eventually reaching the Hamza River. Importance of the Hamza River the Hamza River is an important reservoir of freshwater for the Amazon. It provides water for plants, animals, and human communities. The river also plays an important role in the water cycle in the Amazon rainforest. The plants and animals of the Amazon depend on the Hamza River for their survival. The river provides water for drinking, irrigation, and reproduction. The human communities that live in the Amazon also depend on the Hamza River for their drinking water. The Hamza River also plays an important role in the water cycle in the Amazon. It helps to transport rainwater to the Atlantic Ocean. The water cycle is important for the Amazon rainforest because it helps to maintain soil moisture and plant growth. Future Research Scientists are conducting research to better understand the Hamza River. They are studying the formation of the river, the maintenance of the flow of the river, and the importance of the river to the Amazonian ecosystem. Chemical Composition of the Water of the Hamza River Scientists are interested in studying the chemical composition of the water of the Hamza River. They want to know if the water is drinkable and if it contains nutrients that can support aquatic life. Aquatic life that lives in the Hamza River. Scientists are also interested in studying the aquatic life that lives in the Hamza River. They want to know what types of animals and plants live in the river and how they are adapted to the subterranean environment. Impact of the Hamza River on the water cycle in the Amazon. Scientists are also interested in studying the impact of the Hamza River on the water cycle in the Amazon. They want to know how the river affects the amount of water that stays in the Amazon rainforest and how it affects the climate of the region. These research can help scientists to better understand this important river and its role in the Amazonian ecosystem. Hey everyone! I hope you learned a little bit more about the Hamza River. As we saw, the Hamza River is a very special underground river. It is the largest known underground river, with about 6,000 kilometers in length and flowing at a depth of about 4,000 meters. The Hamza River is an important reservoir of freshwater for the Amazon. It provides water for plants, animals, and human communities. The discovery of the Hamza River was an important discovery for science. It provided new information about the hydrogeology of the Amazon and can help scientists better understand the workings of the water cycle in the Amazon rainforest. There are still many things we don't know about the Hamza River. Scientists are conducting research to better understand the formation, maintenance of flow, importance, and future research on the Hamza River. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.